But we begin with that breaking news out of Linda Vista. A preschool just reopened from a lockdown after an officer shot a man just feet away. 10 News reporter Rachel Bianco is there where it is still roped off. Rachel? Kimberly and Steve, this entire city block remains a crime scene and there are still several investigators gathering evidence from near the school. It has been a terrifying afternoon for the many witnesses who saw the man try to shoot two kids and for the parents who rushed to the Vine Preschool moments after a guy with a gun barged onto the property. Now this happened at the intersection of Ulrich and Comstock just before two this afternoon. It is a busy area. The shooting happened right in front of the library, the preschool, the post office, and just as kids were getting out of school. Witnesses told us they saw an adult arguing with two teenage boys. They were screaming and swearing at each other right in front of the preschool. Witnesses say at one point the adult pulled out a gun and fired at both kids at close range, but missed. The kids took off running. The man took off towards the preschool. He jumped the fence. It's unclear if the officer shot him before or after he reached the school property. It was nap time for the 100 children inside. Fortunately, they did not know what was happening. We talked to one dad as he was picking up his daughter after the lockdown was lifted. Yeah, you know, I'm just uh, I'm happy the police contained the situation before um, the suspect got inside the classroom. You know, they really help out our community. We live in a crazy day and age, and uh, this is the best school my kids have ever gone to. We don't know the condition of the man police shot. Uh, right now, investigators are on the other side of the street. We have another crew over there, and they are holding a news conference, giving the latest on exactly what happened out here, and we'll have that for you coming up new at 7 o'clock. Reporting live in Linda Vista, Rachel Bianco, 10 News. Thank you, Rachel.